we begin with NBC Bay Area's Gene Ellie, who is in Napa tonight at one of those debris drop off points. Gene. Jessica, the city is letting people drop off their debris at about a dozen locations here in town. We're here at Napa High School. Take a look. You can see everything from decking to furniture is trashed. And this debris pile, it just keeps growing as Napa is in cleanup mode. We all have a lot of cleanup to do, but uh, a lot of people don't have anything to clean up. A day after an earthquake started a fire at the Napa Valley Mobile Home Park, destroying three homes. Gloria Lewis is feeling grateful. But with crews still working to restore water service. I'm exhausted. See here, you get the same thing, huh? I am. <laughs> People who live here are busy dipping into the swimming pool. Jugs and pails and uh, pool water and my little wagon here. Lewis and her neighbors are taking home buckets of water to keep the bathroom fresh. The toilets get a little ripe after a while. So, yeah, we're using it for toilet water. Enjoy. Thank you. With gas service also needing repair, the Salvation Army is serving breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And people like Larry Bennett are helping neighbors clean up. I clean up a gentleman down on Cherry Lane. We worked on that this morning, and then this afternoon I helped the lady over on Mark. At the Napa Valley Mobile Home Park, they're recovering together. Now, people at the Mobile Home Park have been told water service is expected to be restored tomorrow. Their hopeful gas service will follow shortly after that. As for the debris pile, it's expected to continue to grow as cleanup continues. Reporting live in Napa, Ginelli, NBC Bay Area News.